Is right now the best time in recent history for you to buy a new construction home? By now, we all know that mortgage rates are higher than in April and inflation is high too. These factors have led to a real estate slowdown and decline across the country, but real estate is not the only thing. All assets have had a decline. Home builders are much more sensitive to shifts in the market and have been severely impacted by the corrections we've seen. How is this an advantage to buyers in the market for new construction homes? Hey everyone, Spencer Sue here, your tech road through the Bay Area. I'm excited to tell you why now is a great time to buy, but before we do, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to my channel so you never miss out on another video. You can see a whole list of new construction videos right over here. Okay, let's first talk about what's happened with new constructions over the course of the first part of 2022 since a lot has changed since then. Early this year, home prices were for new construction in the United States were at an all-time high and there was not enough new inventory to meet record demand. We had a bounty of buyers in the market taking advantage of these low rates. Now, as inflation picked up, the Fed had to change its policies and aggressively increase rates. With the Fed's rate increases, mortgage rates have increased, pricing out many buyers and forcing them to rent further. These factors are why home builders are in a very vulnerable position right now. Their completion costs have skyrocketed, while the number of new buyers has plummeted, causing resale prices to decline. Transaction volume has fallen by half. What are they to do? The production of new construction properties has also been on decline, and there's still a national shortage of homes in the long term. There are also balance sheet challenges in the short run. Builders still need to sell to clear their balance sheets. This is an opposite situation as to what we saw in the beginning of the year. This ample inventory now can give buyers tons of leverage. Given the way things have gone for new construction properties over the last few months, how can you take advantage of the situation right now to secure a deal. There are many ways a buyer can capitalize and these are the core methods. You can negotiate a lower price, get a mortgage rate discount to buy down a rate, include options and upgrades in purchase deals, using credits to help with closing costs. Buyers are in a great position today and you could also even make an offer for homes which is unheard of for new construction. Now, there is nothing different between a home today than a home a few months ago when things were selling like hotcakes. As a buyer, you still become a new construction homeowner. If you're currently renting, you still get out of the rental market so you can start building up equity. Remember, these short-term things will come and go and think for the long-term of your goals. I do wanna hear from you guys. Would you buy a brand new house in today's market? Leave it in the comments below. Also, be sure to hit the like button and remember to subscribe to the channel. Now, if you're looking to buy or sell anywhere in the Bay Area, new construction or not, my team would love to be your trusted real estate resource. So be sure to call or text 408-547-4590 about your real estate future. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.